Tara Connor got a second chance. The winner of Miss USA 2006 was tarnished by reports of drug and alcohol abuse, as well as pictures of her kissing that year's Miss Teen USA winner. She subsequently tested positive for cocaine eight months into her brain and seemed a lot to lose the crown. Miss USA owner Donald Trump called a televised press conference, but rather than firing her, he gave her a second chance and let her keep the title. Connor went to rehab and now serves as a public advocacy consultant for Karen Treatment Centers, among other minor media roles. The incident also sparked the feud between Trump and Rosie O'Donnell. Bert Parks, there he was. Bert Parks, the longtime MC of the Miss America pageant. At that point, pageant organizers dumped the aging Parks, believing he was no longer a suitable public face for an event eager to attract younger viewers. Parks was fired with such little class that he learned of it in a reporter. Subsequently, Johnny Carson organized a letter-writing campaign demanding his reinstatement. While Parks had a cameo on the show in 1990, he never appeared again and died two years later. Daniel Lloyd dated a pageant judge. The former Miss Great Britain 2006, Lloyd was stripped of her title after revelations surfaced that she had posed for Playboy and had dated one of the pageant judges. After the scandal died down, Lloyd became a UK tabloid celebrity. She had allegations of racism made against her on the UK version of Big Brother, had four children, married and divorced. Steve Harvey crowned the wrong Miss Universe. Chaos ensued when host Steve Harvey accidentally crowned the wrong Miss Universe in December 2015. He accidentally read the cue card wrong and announced that Ariadne Gutierrez Arevalo at the Miss Columbia was the winner. After she received the crown, she performed the traditional ritual wave to the crowd. Harvey came back out on stage when she was finished and delivered the devastating news. As Columbia was actually the first runner-up, the real first place winner was Paya Alonzo Wurzbach from the Philippines. Leona Gage lied about basically everything. The winner of Miss USA 1957 held the crown for exactly one day, losing the title after her mother-in-law revealed that not only was she married with two children, but that she'd lied about her real age. Apparently Gage had met her husband at age 13, married at age 14, and had two kids by age 18, all major no nos in beauty pageant land. The scandal made her a massive media figure for a short time, and she later published a book, attempted suicide, and married six times. She died at the age of 71. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below. And also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.